State versus Joshua Crawford, 16-100, charged with criminal mischief in the first degree. The Honor, Mr. Crawford is also here on case number 15-219, uh, where the court has issued a failure to appear. Uh, he's not filled out an application on 16-100, which I'd ask the court to order him to do. Uh, I anticipate nothing will have changed, Your Honor, so I will go ahead and enter a plea of not guilty on that charge. Um, Your Honor, when Mr. Brown or uh, Mr. Parnell, I don't know if they want to be called out here in court, if they'll stay on his bond, I'll ask that the court reinstate his bond. Sir, uh, fill out another application if you want to be represented by the public defender in your new case. And I'll have you reappear before Judge Webb on April 28th. Mr. Cooper, why did he not appear on March 24th? Your Honor, I'll let him tell the court that. Uh, Your Honor, I thought it was on the 28th, and I just misheard the days. Where do you live at? Uh, with my grandparents. Where do they live at? Uh, in Midway or Gasville. Your Honor, his grandmother is here in court. She's been very faithful in appearing in court. Uh, we've had Mr. Crawford before in our office. Um, I think that if the court uh, would reinstate the bond, which First Arkansas is willing to stay on, I just confirmed that with Mr. Parnell, and he'd be ordered to stay with his grandmother. Um, that. Uh, that's about as good as we could hope for today, Judge. The bonds will file something with the court saying we'll extend the bond. He can be released on his prior bond. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you. Sir. State versus Michelle Shook, 16101. Breaking or entering. I'm out of appointment to the public defender's office to represent you. Judge, based on that appointment, we'll waive reading of the information and their plea of not guilty. We ask that a scheduling order go ahead and be issued in this case. The bond will not be an issue at this time. Okay. Very well. We'll enter the plea of not guilty. Judge, if you want to give July 21st for a pretrial. Okay, July 21st will be the. Okay, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. State versus Hannah Miller, 16-103. Possession of controlled substances and paraphernalia. <coughs> Hannah Miller, Your Honor. Okay. Ma'am, I've appointed the public defender's office to represent you. Looks like you're appearing for an arraignment. Judge, we're actually going to go ahead and enter a, a plea, a negotiated okay. plea. The state has agreed to null pros the D felony that Hannah's been charged with. We're going to enter a plea of guilty to the misdemeanor. All right. We will give the court a uh, judgment before we leave today. She's already on felony probation. We're going to have her meet with the probation officer while she's here today. Very well. Thank you, Your Honor. State versus James Davis, 16104, possession of controlled substances and paraphernalia. Good morning, sir. Morning. You have a lawyer? Sir. Do you intend to hire a lawyer or make application to public defender's office? Public defender, you say? Sir. Okay. Have you made an application yet? Okay. Uh, well, there should be an application at the jail. Fill it out uh, as soon as you can and turn it in. Your case is before Judge Webb. I'll have you reappear on. Let's see. April 28th for attorney status and uh, arraignment. Sir, um, I was wondering if there was any way I could get an OR. My grandma's been in a hospital for over three weeks down at Baptist Memorial in Little Rock. There's no other way I can bond out. Okay. I I'll, I'll, I'll be at court. What I'll did never... you say is happening in Little Rock? She's in uh, the hospital at Baptist oh. Memorial. Okay, let me look at you, what you allegedly did to get you in this situation. Are you on probation? On parole. Parole, okay. Was there a parole hold on this gentleman, you know? No, they lifted it. At the present time, there's not, John. We would have some issues with him being on a lot of bond, though. Well, I'll tell you what, go ahead and fill out your application as soon as you can, and, and uh, if you qualify, maybe your lawyer can talk to the prosecutor's office and the sheriff's department, see if they can work something out, okay? Thank you. 
but we'll go out of order a bit and take up uh, Miss uh, Anna Renault. Is that correct? That's correct, Your Honor. Judge, we have been in um, serious plea negotiations in this case. I think we are close. Anna has more questions that she wants to ask me and that we need to communicate about a little bit more. Um, we're not completely rejecting it at this time. I will let the state know as soon as possible if that's the case. However, at this time, we'll just leave it as scheduled. And this is a charges of aggravated robbery and uh, criminal attempt. I mean, the class A felony. Okay, we'll leave it as scheduled. Thank you, Your Honor.